I think that's enough of that for now. Fond of the show, aren't you? Okay, come on. Let's get you down to the observation room. This must be starting to feel like home to you. Don't worry. I'll try and get you out of here eventually. I'm just in here. Okay, are we through in the next room? Just relax and we'll get started in a moment. Right, Mr. Asian, now are you ready? Just hit record on the tape deck in front of you when you're ready. This is subject 12198623, new session entry. We have myself, Dr. Alexander, leading, and in a room we have our patient, Mr. James Asian. As we know, James has recently recovered from a two-week coma following his accident. In our last three sessions, James's attempts to recollect events of the accident seen him merging his memory with his imagination. These episodes have always ended in panic, and we've had to terminate the session abruptly. Let's try and do this one better, James. So when you're ready, let's bring this back. I know how difficult this must be, but you can do this. James, it's time to remember. Your mind, it's like a conscious black box. It can show you your memories. Look into it. from the rest of the world, locked inside your coma. We interacted with you daily, encouraging you to wake. Your family would do number puzzles with you. Anything, really, to bring you back. People needed answers, James. Do you remember? I have another signal here for you, James. It's at 5610FM. You can't miss it. Twenty F twelve nineteen 
86 23 04. Type in the numbers, James. You gotta see this. This is 20F 12 19 86 23 04. Type in the numbers, James. You gotta see this. This is 20. Find the signal, James. Listen to the voices. You have to face it, James. Finally. Six years and not once have we even talked about alcohol. Drunk driving. He, he was a father, a, a husband, he was fine. No way he caused this. It's him, this Haitian guy. He's got something to hide. Imagination from a station. I guess it's from the shows he's been watching. This time he described a, an A and E visit as a government conspiracy. Or something. It's, uh, it's interesting stuff. And it's obviously pure fiction. But I guess it's just his way of coping for now. We'll see how we progress in future sessions. him lying there sobbing while his sister died in the car next to him while Hennings died next to him what the, what the fuck was he thinking she was still alive when we got to her if he'd have done something they could all still be here today was the first session with mr. James Asian although I fear it will certainly not be his last when asked about events that have happened in the past, he confused fact and fiction and told us a story about a computer game that was talking to him. I think he was back at his own house, his mum and dad's house, and he always talked about a room with a red X, one he couldn't get in. I don't know what any of this means or what it's going to do with the accident, but I guess uh, some more sessions will maybe... You honestly believe that Henning was drunk at the wheel and not this little shit? If he wakes up, when he wakes up, I want answers. Until then, you handle it. You write it up. I'm out. Okay, we have a 22-year-old male just brought in from a vehicle collision. He was awake and mobile at the scene, but collapsed on arrival to the emergency ward. The other passengers died in the accident. I'm getting no pulse. Prepare for defib. Amp charge full to 10 and give me 100 joules. Come on, 100 joules. Charge amp full to 10. Clear. Charging up full to 10. No reaction from first stage. 
Let's try higher. 200 joules. Keep the amp charge at 10. 200 joules. Keep the charge at 10. Let's go. Clear. Okay, we have a reaction of some sort here, a weak signal. Let's keep going. Increase again. 360, charge full. Come on, 360, hurry. Clear. Well, would you look at that? It seems we have a pulse. Rhythm is stable. We need to run an x-ray right away. Where are we with that x-ray? Let's get it going now, please. on the screen, please. See what I'm doing. Get this on the screen now. <sighs> Looks like an intracerebral hemorrhage. We need to drain this now to relieve pressure. Prepare for trepanation. Switch on a drill, please. Station, you've made excellent progress. You're doing great. You need to stay calm and try to relax while we go through these next steps. We're going to attempt to alleviate some of this discomfort.
I'm sorry, I don't understand. We tried our best, Mrs. Asian, but her injuries were too severe. No, I don't understand. I was just talking to her. I'm afraid Jennifer passed away before we could get to her in surgery. We did the best we could. I am so sorry. Where is she? Let me see her. Please, Mrs. Asian, take a seat. I don't want to take a seat. Let me talk to her. Now. I'll arrange for you to see her. In the meantime, James is in recovery. He's stable for now. I don't want to see him. You're all over the place, James. Pull over. James, for fuck's sake, pull over! This very moment, wasn't it, James? The moment you lost it all. Your sister, your parents, yourself. 
And then you made it worse. Go on. Show us what you did. into that officer and you wrecked all of our lives. And then you couldn't even take responsibility. You did the right thing for you and no one else. Save yourself. Only it was wrong, wasn't it? Look at you now. Utterly consumed by it. Say it, James. Tell them. Well, I think we've made progress today, Mr. Asian. I guess we should tell the police what you've told us. Although I don't suspect they'll take you anywhere. I think you'll be with us for quite some time. Come on, let's get you back to your shows. I'll see you tomorrow.
Thank you very much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please help us out by giving us a thumbs up and hitting that subscribe button. If you really liked what you saw, consider donating to keep the website and channel running by buying us a coffee via our coffee page or picking up some merch from our big cartel store. You can check us out on gbhbell.com as well as via our social media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, as well as listen to our interviews via SoundCloud, Apple Music, and Spotify. Just search for GBHBL. Games, horror, and heavy metal. What else is life for?